My name is Connie Lagali, and I'm, uh, I do a lot of socialization with cats. I try to make them more comfortable with people. Sometimes animals coming in here are terrified. Sometimes they've had bad experiences. Sometimes they've been neglected or abused. Sometimes they've been thrown out and have been having trouble finding water and food and shelter and so forth. Sometimes they're just, just scared for whatever reason. And so you have to work with them for over a long period of time sometimes to get them comfortable sitting in somebody's lap, getting petted, getting combed or brushed, just feeling comfortable with people and sometimes other animals. Like for example, we've had a couple of cases recently where the owner has died and that cat has not known another life without that owner. And so they come and they're just lost, they're confused and depressed and so you have to work with them a long time to get them sociable again. We've had also cases, for example, we've had one cat that came in with several siblings and one by one they got adopted until there was just the one and she was just not happy at all. She didn't know how to handle being by herself and uh, worked with her for probably two or three months trying to get her more comfortable with people and uh, last week came in and she had gotten adopted so that was so nice. I love cats anyway and I love animals but I especially I, I'm better with cats. I started volunteering here when some things at work sometimes weren't necessarily the greatest and I could come here and have a different perspective on life, different look at things, and that's helped a lot. It's also shown me all the different things that cats need to become a, more adoptable. I mean, anybody can be adopted, but the ones that are friendly and comfortable with people and so forth can get adopted more easily, so they, they need a lot of that.